There's an argument that the expression to get hold of the wrong end of the stick comes from toilet paper, Roman toilet paper, which was the sponge on the end of a long stick, so you wouldn't want to touch the wrong end. <laughs> toilet paper in the Middle Ages is a little bit of leaf, a little bit of straw, something like that, unless you're Henry VIII. Henry VIII has fancy toilet paper, so do noblemen, and it's not paper at all. It's linen, cotton, or blanket to wipe the nether end. And the cloth is washed and then reused, which sounds horrible. And there's a very important servant at court whose name is the groom of the stool. The stool is the closed stool. It's Henry VIII's padded, seatless velvet stool that's placed over the chamber pot. And the groom of the stool literally hands the king what he's going to use to wipe his bottom, which sounds horrible, but actually it's a key job at court because you're intimate with the king if you're doing this job. You can ask him for a favour at the right moment. In the 18th century, we start to hear about paper coming into use, but it's not new paper, it's used paper. And even today, if you get junk mail to your house, you may well call it bump, and that's short for bum fodder used junk mail in the in the toilet. In the 19th century, finally, we get the invention of um, industrially produced toilet paper, but it's that stiff, crackly stuff. Only in the 1920s do we get soft tissue. We've gone soft and effeminate and lax in the 20th century. Mm -hmm.